Okay, I trust that you've already watched the other video where we sewed off on this thick grade of genuine cowhide. And again, if the camera's nice and tight, you can see for yourself how ridiculously thick it, that is. You know, in all likelihood, you're never going to have to sew something that thick. But you know what? We want to have so much, uh, we want to give our buyers so much confidence in our machines because we have so much confidence that we're actually going to double the stakes. You can see them side by side. This is our original sew off, a very thick layer of genuine cowhide. Now we have the same cowhide, but we're doubling it. So I'm going to set this one to the side. Follow me down to the needle. And let me say, as we head down to the needle, you can see that I've left the original piece where this leather, when we acquired it, as far as I could tell, was probably used on some sort of a saddle assembly. You can see that piece right there. So you know what? It doesn't get any tougher than that when you're talking about thickness factor. All right, I'm going to slide this into position. That's a little snug. So I'm going to kind of wiggle it through a little bit, try to get it into position. Lower that presser foot. We kind of go up and down a little bit to get it nicely seated. All right, here we go. Two super thick layers of genuine cowhide. I kind of slid off the pedal there a little bit, so I'm sorry for that slow start. Let me show you what this machine did with that. That right there... I'll tell you one thing, for going through that much cowhide, that is the best top stitch that I've ever seen for that much of a task. I mean, ridiculously difficult. I'm going to rotate it like this. Check that out from the side. You know what? Two layers that thick, it's almost ridiculous. It's almost impossible. Not for one of the machines that I've serviced. And look at that lock-in on the back. You know what? When you can go through this much leather, Look at that again from the side. And you can get a lock-in stitch of that caliber and that quality. You know what? I think this machine could sew patio blocks if it wanted to.